I look at what's going to be happening over the next couple of days. Really, uh, some changes going on. Uh, here's where we are for the overnight hours. Now, Outer Banks, yes, Hatteras Island especially, you'll still see some showers. And it'll still be rather breezy overnight and during the day for tomorrow. 10 to 20 mile an hour winds generally out of the northeast. We'll see a lot more cloud cover moving on in for the day tomorrow. There's where things are at 7 in the morning. We work our way through the day. I think we'll see highs generally a little cooler near the water's edge and into the low to mid 60s farther inland. I think most of us, though, into the upper 50s for the afternoon tomorrow. That's slightly cooler than what we saw for the day on Monday. A lot more cloud cover and, again, that breeze out of the northeast. But that changes overnight. Becoming more easterly, we could see a stray shower move in overnight. There's where things are by Wednesday morning. A little better chance of seeing some rain as a low-pressure area south of Hatteras moves northward through the region and then exits the region rather quietly uh, coming up during the day on Wednesday. 57 against Still breezy out of the northeast for the day on Tuesday. Slight chance of rain late in the day, more likely on Tuesday night. Wednesday, yeah, I think we'll see a few showers into the area. 63. Look at that, though. Thursday and Friday temperatures into the 70s. We'll see a chance of rain, but not a washout for the day on Friday.